So I just checked out this first episode of this new Korean drama or this Korean show on Netflix titled My Demon. The first episode was called Living in the Mist. I watched the trailer to the show, so I was expecting some type of rom-com type show. The trailer didn't show much, but I did enjoy the chemistry of the two leads, so that's why I decided to watch this one. Um, but... Yeah, this wasn't what I thought it was going to be. It was more of a fantasy drama, of course, with some comedy and romance in there and drama. But this was a really good show. This was a really good start to the season. Uh, it got me interested in the rest of it. Uh, I like the chemistry between the two leads, which is Song Kong and Kim Yoo Young. I thought those two were great together. The dialogue between the two of them were great. The characters, I like the dynamics between the two of them. I don't want to give away too much. This isn't going to be like a full review. Just giving you guys my thoughts on episode one. Won't give any spoilers or anything, but basically the show is about this one guy. This guy who, I, he's a demon. Um, He's... Uh, the mortal and he's collecting on different debts and stuff and he comes into contact with uh kim yu young's character who is dohi i believe and yeah somehow they become intertwined with each other and it and yeah they have a good connection with each other but she's a ceo of a company he is immortal he's collected on different debts doing his thing and somehow he comes into contact with her and their dynamic is really good together I also like some of the other cast in this show, some of the other characters in this show, especially that come into contact with the main guy. Don't know his name, <laughs> to be honest with you, because some of the subtitles were moving too fast for me. But for the most part, I got all that I needed to get. But yeah, this is a good start. I will be looking forward to checking out the rest of the show. I'm liking the cinematography, especially some of the shots in the be in the beginning. I like the use of the different shots. Um, but there was some weird stuff that I don't understand. It. But there was a whole lot of white cars in the show. Bro, what are you talking about, man? I don't know why that was. But yeah, there was I, like white cars right next to each other the whole episode. I don't know what the symbolism between that was. But yeah, I'm liking the show, liking the fantasy elements. The two leads, like I said, were really great together, had good chemistry. And I like the witty dialogue between the two. And their characters seem like they're going to be a, a good watch, at least for me personally. So I will be checking out the rest of the season. Did do a reaction to episode one. Don't know if I will react to the rest of the season, but I will be watching the rest of it. And like I said, the trailer, if you guys check out the trailer, it doesn't show much, but it will give you at least a hint of at least the two leads chemistry between the two, each other. The visuals are great. The dialogue is fantastic and the story is really good and surprising for me personally. Like I said, I thought this was going to be a rom-com. You got those elements, but you also got some fantasy and uh, some action as well. And a few other dramatic and stuff moments in it. And I really like the dynamic between all the leads as well as the other people that come into contact with our main guy who has a lot of charisma and swagger, apparently. But yeah, I like. I like this show. I will be checking out the rest of the season. Let me know your thoughts on episode one in the comment section below. This show is going to be 16 episodes dropping weekly on Netflix. I believe they've already released six episodes already. So I'm about five episodes behind, but I will be catching up really soon, checking out the rest of the season. So be on the lookout for a season one review. I really like this one. This is one of the few Korean dramas I've checked out. Want the rest of them being like Squid Games, All of Us Are Dead, um, and a few movies like Train to Busan and a, f a few other ones. And I've liked all those so far. So this was a really good one. A uh, different dynamic that I've seen, a different genre that I've seen out of the Korean dramas I've watched. And yeah, I enjoyed it. I thought it was really good. A really good start to this show. Good chemistry, good acting, good, good everything all around, honestly. So I would recommend this show. Would recommend that you guys at least check out episode one and see if this is something that you would like. It is on Netflix, like I said. I don't know where it is in other parts of the world. It says it's a Netflix original, but sometimes they repackage um, content from other countries and market it as originals in other countries other than its origin. So look for it, My Demon. The, it's on Netflix, like I said, for me. So 
This is a good watch. Check it out. Let me know your thoughts on episode one in the conversation below. Be sure to subscribe. Check out for more videos. And let me know what else you guys want me to review or give you guys my thoughts on in the future. I won't be doing any like traditional type reviews. So be on the lookout for this style of review, I guess. Just giving you guys my thoughts on certain things. Maybe you guys will vibe with it. Maybe you guys you won't. What? What? <laughs> Maybe you guys will vibe with it. Maybe you guys won't. But at least give it a chance. Check it out. I thought it was great. That's it. Good job.